they, they don't well, they won't convert to Islam, so they're being beheaded. So, so why why would why would you want to you know be happy to accept anyone in Australia who who is peace loving? But I haven't seen any. Then why don't they come and worship in their church? No, right, we're not we're not against people. We're not against people. We're not against people. What we're against is the religion, the spirit. We're against we're against the spirit of what it teaches. No, no, no. We're against it. Religion that teaches that they have a right to con they kill people who don't believe in what they what they. That's the radical thing. Why, why, why would we? Why would we do that? Why would we support that? There was. There are radicals in every religion, and there are people. If you have a right to yeah. um, um, your religion, well, of course, you want to Let me ask you a question. Let me ask you a question. Let me ask you a question. I haven't seen any um, any uh, Muslim people who have been. Uh, protesting against people being beheaded. Where are they? Where are all these peace-loving people? Who, where are all these peace-loving people who are protesting against people being beheaded? I, I, I Shut up for a minute. Shut up. Stop talking. Stop talking. What, what? Are you going to are you going to kill me if I don't believe in what you say? Uh, no. Just stop talking. I let somebody else talk. I spent. 10 years working in Indonesia, 200 million Islam, Islamic people there, the most kindest, gentle, decentest people, they didn't, they didn't have, come to they didn't come to Australia and behead people. How many people in Australia have been beheaded? Well, there, there would have been a few if we hadn't. If it hadn't have been you going around waving a flag. No, no look, why is it then that you can tell me this? Why is it people have been brought up in in the UK, in Australia, in in Western countries who've got the benefit? They come to Australia. Why do they leave their countries? Why? Tell me that. Why do they leave their countries? Because your you and your ancestors left your country. That's why. Yes. Yeah, come to Australia. No, come to Australia for a better for a better world. So, if they want to sw uh, swear allegiance to Australia and democracy, that's fine. But, but why? Why, why do they go back? Like why Jesus. do they go back and out of Australia and and prepare to lay down their life? For, I'll tell for you. What they I'll believe. tell you. Oh, no, I'll tell you. I'll, oh, I'll, okay. I'll tell you why they go back. Is because you they, the believe, they believe. They believe. They believe their religion. Have they believe that is the reason. They believe that they have a right to kill people. Okay. I will answer your question. This is my, I'll answer your question. Do you sing that song? Is this what you sing, the Australian anthem? Do you sing this? Do you sing this? Australian? You're holding a flag that has a flag. I'm happy. I'm happy. I am happy to welcome anyone in oh, yes. Australia. Yeah. 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 Go home. Like, I'm happy to welcome anyone to Australia who who puts Australia first. But I, I'm not happy to welcome a religion that teaches death to anyone who doesn't follow that religion. Then you should be a Christian, then, should you? So you, so you who said I was a Christian? Well, this lady here was saying, I, I thought you guys were together because you know it's like the whole. Does, does Christianity teach death to people who don't follow it? Oh, it does not. That's not. That, that's, that, that's not. That you, you are. Okay, okay. Now, no, listen to this, right? Listen to this. Okay, who supports gay people here, gay marriage and that? You do. Well, what do you think they want to do? They want to kill people who are gay. I don't get you guys in here. Of course they do. You know, Australians need to wake up. Australians need to wake up. Yeah. That's what they believe. Wake up, Australia. Mum and Dad, Australians, wake up for your children.